For years, AMD was the quiet rival, always a step behind NVIDIA, always chasing, never leading. NVIDIA was the face of the AI revolution, the chip maker everyone turned to when it came to powering artificial intelligence. Meanwhile, AMD was best known for powering gaming rigs and budget-friendly PCs. But in 2025, that story began to change because now, AMD isn't just chasing NVIDIA, they're closing the gap, and some are saying they might actually be winning. Let's rewind a bit. NVIDIA's rise wasn't an accident. It came from one bold insight. Graphics chips, originally designed for video games, were perfect for training AI models. The result? NVIDIA's H100 chips quickly became the gold standard for AI infrastructure worldwide. By the time the tech world fully grasped the value of these chips, NVIDIA had already locked up the market. Meanwhile, AMD was watching from the sidelines. But behind closed doors, they were quietly building their own secret weapon, the MI300. This wasn't just another graphics chip. It was designed from the ground up for AI, packed with advanced memory, optimized for massive workloads, and priced to compete aggressively with NVIDIA. When the first reviews rolled in, the industry took notice. AMD had created a real challenger, then the unexpected. Just as AMD was gearing up for a big launch, the US government imposed export restrictions on advanced AI chips going to China. That put a huge question mark over AMD's growth plans. China is one of the largest and fastest growing AI markets on Earth. It looked like a major setback, but AMD didn't back down. They adapted. They redesigned the chip slightly, creating the MI308, a version that met export regulations, but still packed a punch. And in mid-2025, the US government approved shipments again. Suddenly, AMD was back in the game with a competitive AI chip ready to flood one of the world's biggest markets. Wall Street responded fast. HSBC raised their price target on AMD stock to $200 per share. Jefferies called AMD the dark horse of AI investors started piling in. In just one quarter, AMD's data center revenue soared by an astonishing 57%. That's billions in new business not just hype. But the story goes deeper than numbers. NVIDIA dominates the high end of the market, the ultra-powerful chips for massive AI models. AMD, they're going after the rest, not just chips, but full AI systems, not just US customers, but global cloud providers, not just training models, but inference and edge computing. Then came AMD's smart move, acquiring ZT Systems. ZT might not be a household name, but in data center circles, they're a powerhouse, building custom AI servers for huge hyperscale customers. With that acquisition, AMD moved beyond selling chips. They started building entire server racks, complete AI infrastructure solutions. It's a bold move following NVIDIA's playbook, but leaner, more agile, and priced to win. How did AMD get here? A lot of credit goes to one person, Dr. Lisa Street. When she took the reins as CEO in 2014, AMD was struggling on the brink of irrelevance. She bet big on new tech, investing heavily in chiplet designs, pushing aggressively into data centers, and forging partnerships many thought impossible. That gamble is paying off. Under Lisa Su's leadership, AMD isn't just surviving. They are shaping the future of computing. Still, NVIDIA remains the king. Their Blackwell B100 chips are rolling out, powering AI giants like Microsoft, Meta, and Amazon. They hold the lion's share of AI infrastructure, and they're not going quietly. But AMD has momentum, not buzz or hype real customers, real deployments, real chips moving off shelves. While NVIDIA faces supply chain constraints and sky-high prices, 
AMD's chips are available, affordable, and winning deals with cloud providers hungry for alternatives. This isn't a simple David versus Goliath story, it's chess. And AMD is playing a long strategic game. They're not trying to beat NVIDIA overnight. They're slowly, methodically carving out their own market share, one smart move at a time. It's working. For every flashy NVIDIA keynote, AMD quietly lands new customers, powers more servers, and expands its presence. They've partnered with Microsoft to power Azure AI workloads. They've gained ground in Europe and Asia, especially with the lifted China export restrictions. They're betting heavily on inference, where efficiency and cost matter more than raw power. Analysts who once dismissed AMD as a secondary player are starting to change their tune. This is no longer a one-horse race. It's a battle for the future of computing, and AMD, once an underdog, now has a seat at the table. A few years ago, nobody would have imagined this. Now, every investor, every tech giant, every cloud provider is watching AMD closely. Because in the biggest tech shift since the internet boom, AMD isn't just competing. They're a serious contender. Not just in AI chips, but in shaping the future of technology itself? If stories like this fascinate you, where tech giants clash and underdogs rise, hit that subscribe button